Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I was just sitting down at my vanity and I was just doing some stuff with my camera and my laptop and I was just, and then I just sat down and I was like, I can just, I was looking at my drawer, my tray of concealers and I was like, I can probably, I should probably do a video telling you guys about my favorite concealers. I have quite a few of her, but I do have quite a few that I really like and enjoy and I just want to share with you what I'm enjoying. Um, I know I have a lot of colors going on. But I'm just chilling in my room and um, this is just me and I want to give you me. I want to be authentic and I don't want to just like come over here all the time, you know, face beat and, you know, looking like I'm going somewhere because a lot of times I'm just home chilling. Please excuse my nails. I'm missing like two nails, but we're going to fix that before I leave and go somewhere tomorrow. Um, so I have drugstore and quite a few beauty supply and I have two high end. I'm going to leave the high end for last. Favorite concealer is the LA Girl Pro Conceal. Well, hold on. They're not necessarily in like favorite. These are just all of my favorite. I've been using these for years now and the color that I love to use the most is Toast have toast that's what I use for under my under my eyes and to highlight I will say that they have changed the color toast I mean if you think about it you have they're mass producing like thousands of concealers all the time and I mean you don't think I don't expect to get like the exact same color every time but it was kind of drastic when I when I picked it up the last time but yeah it's still a good concealer and it's still a good shade but I just wanted to mention that so my favorite color is toast and the one I use to spot conceal and I use this as a foundation is dark cocoa so this is toast and this is dark cocoa I have other colors but these are the two that I use the most so I'm gonna just put these back in my I have a tray right here um the next one that I love now I know I said I love full coverage concealer this is not full coverage at all this is like I just want to put something on and highlight and to just cover just a little bit but not a lot this is called the Ruby Kisses pure mineral concealer how definite High definition smart blend just pure mineral concealer um this is the color it's called golden honey this color is is kind of like and i think this is why i don't like it as well, I, I like it but this is why maybe i can't get the coverage i need because sometimes when you have lighter colors and concealers and foundation it doesn't cover like your regular color would <coughs> So I think I'm going to go back and get another color of this one. I've had this one for a while. And then I got this one it first came out. And this is called, again, this is Ruby Kisses Pure Mental Concealer. And the color Golden Honey is the color that I have. And like I said, this is just a concealer that you want to throw on. Just to, like, if you have like a BB cream on. And you just want to put something on it um, to conceal that. Just to give you nice brightness. But it still is not going to cover a lot. This is a concealer that you need. And if you are a person that doesn't have a lot of acne or doesn't have dark dark circles under your eye, this will work really good for you. I will recommend this for someone that doesn't have dark circles or doesn't want to spot, con spot conceal or you don't have a lot of cover up basically. So yeah, this is, I like this for that reason. Another concealer is the LA Colors Conceal It cover and correct concealer i like this this reminds me a lot hold on let me show you the applicator of this one this one is not this one is how this one is this is kind of like a lipstick a lip gloss and i 
I think I'm gonna go back in. Now that I, I kind of like got this out my stash, and I think I'm gonna go because they have released new colors since then. I think I'm gonna go get another one soon. I like this. I think I'm gonna go get another one, and I might tell you guys how I like it again. So yeah. <clears throat> and I was talking about the LA Colors concealer. This is called Conceal It. Something's about to roll off my lips. Yeah. This is in the color Deep. This is like the LA Girl. Um, so yeah. And if you don't use your concealers a lot like these, I would advise you to squeeze them out on a tissue because it tends to separate a lot. So yeah, I really like this. This is full coverage and they don't have a lot of colors in this though. This is deep and I think this is the darkest color. As you can tell, it's not that not that dark but yeah I really like this it covers very well and um, y'all hear me talk about these a lot these are my Maybelline instant rewind concealers I love this I really do I like the consistency I like the coverage and I even like the applicator it comes in like a clickable push-up tube you cl it clicks like this and it comes up in this sponge applicator I have two colors I have the color tan and the color hazelnut so yeah these are full coverage and yeah I like the like I said I like the consistency I like how it, the colors of them yeah and they just expanded their um they expanded their color selection a few months back and yeah so go check those out if you haven't my next one uh, i think i've talked about this before too this is my ruby kisses ultra cover dark circle dark circle eraser <laughs> eraser concealer love this concealer love the consistency love the coverage i i really love the color of this one it's not too bright it's not too dark it's just the right color and this is the color mocha <clears throat> And all the, all the concealers I've showed so far, they're very affordable. Um, most of them you can find at the drugstore or at the beauty supply. I don't know if you noticed by now, I love the beauty supply store. They have, I think the beauty supply store is just straight up underrated by a lot of people. They think beauty supply, makeup, oh, it's cheap, it's no good. Girl. And guys, you can find some amazing stuff in the beauty supply store if you just take your time and just look around like you find some really good stuff and my next concealer is my absolute new york concealer this one is called the click cover concealer it's lightweight full coverage and i will say it's lightweight and it's full coverage it's like you click it and it comes up out of this brush tip i love i actually really like the applicator and I like the consistency of this one. It's kind of, it reminds me of the consistency of the LA Girl Pro. And I love it. And this is color is deep neutral. And you can find this at the beauty supply store. Um, next one are my Ruby Kisses Conceal and, Conceal and Define. I have two colors. I love these as well. I haven't, I haven't used these in a while. I think I'm going to bring these back out. I might use it tomorrow. I have the color Golden Chestnut and Toast. I have Golden Chestnut Open. Toast is a little darker. Actually, now that I'm looking at it, Golden Chestnut doesn't... Mm, it looks kind of neutral to me. Toast looks kind of... It looks kind of red. Warm. I know you can't tell by the lights, but yeah. <clears throat> These are good, full coverage. I like the um, the applicator. It's the same as the LA Girl Pro. I think when the LA Girl Pro came out, a lot of people started really liking it. And a lot of these brands kind of like, they was like, okay, y'all like this kind of applicator? We're going to come out with a concealer of our own with the same kind of applicator. Which is how, you know, that's how things work. People come out with their own versions, but a little different. And next is my Revolution Concealer. Concealing Divine. I love these. 
full coverage. Love the consistency. These are kind of not. No, it's not. I was gonna say it's liquidly, liquidly, but it's not. It's actually kind of thick, um, but not too thick. I really like these. I have the color C12 and C15. I mix these because C12 is too light for my skin. C15 is like my skin tone, so I mix these. You can find these at Ulta and online at the Revolution website. <clears throat> the last one that I have for drugstore and beauty supply is my Kiss Pro Touch. I've used this maybe once or twice, but I will put this in because it was full coverage and I really liked it. And now that I think about it, all the all these concealers that I showed, they do not crease on me for the most part and if I set them correctly they do not crease they last long a long time because if you don't last if a concealer doesn't last a long time I don't need it or I don't want it because what's the point if I'm gonna put a concealer it's gonna only gonna last for like three to four hours there's no really no need for me to have it so yeah I like this one I only used it a few times but didn't crease love the consi consistency color and yeah i like it okay i have two high end i'm gonna go with my this one first this is my nars radiant creamy concealer in the color amand amande i don't know how to how to pronounce it but yeah i love this concealer i will say it's not as full coverage as certain other this other concealers but I still like it. It gives me a nice, I like the finish. It's not It's not drying at all. And yeah, I really like this. This is expensive. You can find this at, I don't know if they, I think they sell NARS at Ulta, but I know they sell it at Sephora. And then, of course you can find it online at Sephora. But yeah, this is my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. I like this. And when I was looking for, looking through my stash, trying to figure out, you know, picking out the ones that I love, I, I remember that I don't have one that I really like, and that is the NYX. <sighs> I cannot think of that concealer. It's the NYX concealer that kind of reminds me of the NARS. I cannot think of it. It's in a tube, circle tube. I don't have the kind of threw it away because it was old, but yeah, I really like that one as well. Reminds me of the NARS. And I think this is my first concealer that I ever bought. And I love it. Um, I need to get some more. I have the color. This is, I wasn't going to say the, the name. This is my MAC Pro, Pro Longwear Concealer. These are amazing. I'm not even going to lie. These are really, really good concealers. You can use these for foundations all over the face. You can use it to spot conceal, highlight. I used to use these for, I used to use this almost as a spot conceal and a foundation because it's that full coverage and it just looks so good on the skin. Like, I would suggest this if anyone's looking for, because some people just want high end stuff. I have, no, I don't knock them for anything, for anything like that. You just like what you like. If you're looking for a high end concealer that, you know, works really good. Full coverage, nice finish, MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I have the colors NW50 and NW45. I used to mix these for under my eye and I used to use NW50 all over. But yeah, these are really, really good. Um, like I said, I need to repurchase these because I'm running out. Like <clears throat> you can tell NW50 is a little dark. You can't really see like how much it's gone but yeah it's almost gone whoa nw45 is practically gone so yeah i need to get some more that's though. what i have and i hope this this video help you guys out to pick out some concealers and just give you some choices of some good concealers that you can choose from and that you you know if you take my word for it that they're pretty good so I hope you guys have a great night and I'll see you for Vlogmas Day 4.